it's time for the Yoko's Ground. As you can see, we are standing in the backyard, and that's because in today's video, we are going to plant up two bare root cherry trees in 30 gallon containers. So if you are new here, welcome. And if you are returning, I am so glad to see you again. Let's get to it, y'all. For all the shadows, it's almost six o'clock at night. And so, <laughs> It's just when I could get out here and get things done. So let me show you what I've already done. I put one of those bags in the 30 gallon, uh, in the 30 gallon drum. And inside here, this is, I believe, a 10 gallon planter. And as you can see, it doesn't have any soil. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill the soil around here, and that will leave me a hole in the middle to plant my cherry tree. Okay, as you can see, sorry, I'm out of breath. As you can see, the pot's in there. Now I'm going to pull it back and straighten it up. Okay, so now I'm just going to pull that bucket straight up. And what's going to happen is it's going to leave a hole that is big enough to plant in. And then we will fill it, backfill it with a little bit more, car um, we will backfill it with some more potting soil. Okay, I wanted to show you these two. These are two bare root cherry trees. You can see they're both bare root. I'm gonna put them back in the water. Now one of them is a Bing cherry and the other one is a Rainer cherry. Now these come from onlineorchards.com if you all want to order some and I will link them down in the description for you. Okay, we're gonna plant the Bing in here. Now we're just gonna slowly Pull that up and you can see there is a hole there. So, I don't know if you all can see this right here. This is where they had grafted the tree onto this other tree. That is what allows it to get fruit on it faster and to grow bigger faster. Um, so we're gonna plant it. We're not gonna cover that little knot right there. So let's get it in here, hopefully. I've done it right. Okay, here we go. Now I will have to stake this. Right now I'm just trying to get the soil into it. And now I can put more soil in there. Now no, this is not ideal planting for dwarf cherry trees. But if you all are new here, we are selling this house and moving to a new property. So they will sit in here until we get there. Once we get over there, figure out where the orchard's going, and then we'll put those in there. Let's do the next one. So as I was saying before, these were two bare root cherry trees. This one is a Rainer, this one is a Bing. This one will be the red cherries and this one will be kind of the yellow with the blush on it. Um, I know a lot of people in Texas probably thinking, cherries, trees grow in Texas. Hey, I didn't know it either until recently I had found a, a tree farm out in Burleson that was on Marketplace and I noticed they had cherry trees so I started talking to him and he said there's about five total varieties. I will link, if you are in our area, I will link his tree farm down in the description for you or the information for it. You have to make an appointment to go out there. But I believe he has a pretty good sale going on five foot and 10 foot fruit trees right now. But with that being said, this is not the first time I've grown cherry trees, I'm sorry, fruit trees in 30 gallon containers. I will link my container fruit trees that I've already planted. I planted two, two plums, two nectarines, and an apple, all in 30 gallon containers. All are growing perfectly well. 
Now, if you're new here, then the reason these are getting planted in these 30 gallon containers, and that is because we are moving. We are not staying here. We're moving to a new location. So as soon as we get moved over there, we'll figure out where the orchard's going, and these guys will be going into the ground, as well as my apple and my plums and my nectarines that were over there. So if you are new, please consider subscribing to see more videos like this. If you enjoyed this, you found value in it, please give us a like and a thumbs up. It helps our channel to grow. Until I see you in the next video, you all take care of yourselves. You keep your heads up. And more importantly, no matter how you do it, you keep growing. Bye-bye, y'all.